Hey, good morning again, Bruins, and welcome to another fantastic week here at the city's best and brightest high school. We have a huge week on campus for you this week. It is all about girls and boys varsity uh, basketball programs this week. We have games every day of the week. We've got our boys uh, taking on Alhambra on Tuesday night, coming back on Thursday night, taking on Independence, and then on Friday night, they have a showdown with Camelback. All games start at 4 o'clock for the freshmen with 7 o'clock tip-offs for varsity, 5 o'clock tip-offs for junior varsity. Let's not forget about our Lady Bruins varsity basketball program. They're in action and they actually kick things off this week with the game tonight, Monday night. They're hosting Buckeye in the varsity gym. They return on Wednesday to take on Sunrise Mountain. Action starts at 4 o'clock for the freshmen. Uh, the JV girls tip off at uh, 5.30 and then we have a uh, varsity kickoff at 6.30, 7 o'clock. Come out and support both programs. One of those rare weeks where our varsity basketball programs, either boys or girls, we're hosting a game every single night of the week. Best entertainment ticket in the district. Come out and support Bruins basketball. Also want to uh, send a congratulations out to Coach uh, Stephanie Nelson and Randy Gross for a phenomenal Special Olympics event taking place on our campus last week. Uh, Coach Gross coached our CBT boys basketball program to a second place finish. Unfortunately, they lost to Glendale, but they put forth a tremendous effort and they made our school and our district and our program proud. Spring evaluation season for teachers uh, gets underway this week with your administrators. We're looking forward to a wonderful semester of evaluations and seeing some incredible things in your classes. Lastly, this week kicks off our first two groups uh, for their scheduled Broom Chats. Your opportunity to talk to uh, us about uh, key feedback, ideas, and innovations that you have to make some of the challenges that we face collectively here on campus a little less challenging. Thank you as always for the wonderful work that you do and have a safe and wonderful week.